This afternoon, a Decatur family is the first in the state to report a fire from their Georgia Power smart meter. The utility just finished installing 2.4 million of the meters. Channel 2's consumer investigator Jim Strickland discovered the meters are similar to those that have sparked fires somewhere else. New at 5, Jim breaks the story from DeKalb County. Owners of this Decatur home have had no power for a week ever since their Georgia Power smart meter that was right here erupted in flames. We've now learned one major utility has had so many fire reports with these devices, they're now rethinking smart meters altogether. This is the remains of the meter where the fire obviously started. Elizabeth Copeland White says she and her husband were home to put the fire out. Good thing. You consider yourself lucky? Oh, l blessed. That's a better word. They're now using a generator and a tangle of extension cords. The wiring's fried. After fire shot from around the smart meter Georgia Power had installed years earlier, the power company can read the meters by remote, and they help track outages. All of our customers have been upgraded to them, and we've not had any safety issues. But videos posted by smart meter opponents allege they're a danger. The Philadelphia utility Pico just suspended their installation program after 29 fire reports. They use the same brand of meter. It goes deeper than just me. Georgia Power and a county inspector say the problem here was not the meter, but the gray base box that's part of the house wiring. The utility says they checked it out before switching meters. We do an inspection as thorough as we can, and we will not install a meter if there's any possibility of a safety issue. Williams says they're willing to work with the homeowners to aid in repairs. Copeland White believes the power company ought to pay for all the damages. But if you put a product on my home and that product causes a fire, even though it's limited thanks to us, you have some liability. The charred panel inside the house and concerns about the wiring throughout the house have inflated the repair estimate to this, more than $11,000. Reporting indicator to Cab County, Jim Strickland, Channel 2 Action News.